my channel so in today's video we are finally unboxing the back to school geek gear back to school limited edition box of 2021 now this is late everybody's has had theirs late but in all fairness they did tell us um kept us a little bit updated uh, basically what had happened they'd got all the items for the box but they needed the actual box itself it was late coming to them so it was out of their hands but it's here it is here and yeah i am excited to see it. and it also looks like we have a one two to go with it so yeah i'm really really excited but just for full disclosure this box has been gifted to me to review for you guys yeah i'm excited to see what's in back to school i haven't seen any spoilers i know a few people have had theirs but i haven't seen any spoilers i'm very excited to get into this so if you want to see just as much as i do what is in the back to school limited edition box from geek gear then keep on watching and if this is the first time you see my face hello and welcome to my channel if you love anything to do with harry potter this is the place for you hit that subscribe button because i'd love to have you a massive thank you to these guys these guys are my patreons they help me keep this channel running just that little bit more if you'd like to know anything about patreon it's linked in the description of this video along with my social medias go see what i'm up to on those I don't know if there's something jangling or something's broken. I don't know. We'll soon find out. We're going to put the one to the side. If you've uh, watched my unboxings before, we always do the one last. I nearly didn't let you have the first sneak peek, guys. You always have the first sneak peek. Is it good? Is it worth the wait? Okay, I'm just going to put my hand in. And we're going to pull something out. What is this? Okay. What is this? What is this? How do I get in this? Okay, there's a little tab thing here. Is that a tab thing that I can just pull? Hang on, hang on. Can we just, oh, there, oh, okay. All right, that's quite clever. It's one of them uh, um, thingy bags where it just squishes down. Okay, this is cute. Hang on, let me fluff it, let me fluff her out. We've got a head wig. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's quite cute. I do like that. That's a cute Hedwig. Oh, that is really cute. I'm just looking at Hedwig up there. I've got another teddy. I do love my um I do love my plushes. I do like that. What do you guys think? She's cute. She's cute. That was really clever to put it in one of them so that obviously one, she's kept safe in that bag. And two, it just gives more space in the box. So that was really cool. Right. No, I'm gonna have to look, guys. Okay, so now we're pulling out the t-shirt we normally pull the t-shirt out first so right there seems to be a lot going on on this t-shirt let's have a look <clears throat> what we got the diagon alley is that diagon alley hang on let me have a look yeah i think it is it meant to be diagon alley it looks a bit like the shambles in your hook is it meant to be diagon alley like all the, I think it would be better if the shop signs had actual shop names on them or something. But they're all blank. I'm sure it's, I'm sure that's supposed to be Diagon Alley. Of course it will be. I don't know how I feel about the t-shirt. I love the colours. I just don't know how I feel about it. What do you guys think to the t-shirt? I don't know how I feel about the t-shirt. I don't know. I don't know. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you think. Okay, hands going back in. What's this? Okay, so we have a little... What's this? You know, you're going to know, Susie, if you open it up. Stop saying, what's this? Right, I've got it open. Seems to be some kind of medal. Oh, this is a cool idea. Okay, so we've got... Okay... <clears throat> this looks kind of blue it's a blue is this for ravenclaw it is it's got my it's got lot lot and it says there it says sorted it says sorted lock and we've got the owl you know where dumbledore stands at his standard there's an owl and some candles that's really really cool and that that is a really cool idea so everyone will have their own houses that i really really like that i'm not gonna lie that is really nice that's a really cute idea. Oh, I really like that. I do. I do. I'm first, you know, 
let me just talk a minute hang on i do like this box so far a bit unsure <laughs> Bit unsure about the t-shirt, but Hedwig and the medal, yes. Oh, that's a good cup of tea. Yorkshire tea, you can't beat it. Okay, what do we have in here now? Let's have a look. We have a notebook. We all know how I feel about my notebooks, and I don't have this one. Let me just take the corner off. Okay, so obviously, first glances, it's the acceptance letter. I can never say that. I don't know if anyone's picked it up in videos before, but I say acceptance. It just comes out weird. I don't know why. So we've got a wax seal and it's actually 3D. That's really cool. And then obviously I'm assuming it opens up. Look. Oh, this is nice. <laughs> is, is it a notebook? Oh, it is a notebook. I thought it was actually envelopes and letters. And then, oh, this is actually quite cool. So obviously it opens up. Obviously you take your flap up, open it up like this. And then we've got some oh so you're writing it this way the lines are this way oh fancy and then on all the pages we have got the hogwarts crest and then at the back it's yeah it's all the houses you've got all the house mascots you've got time turner harry's glasses and lightning bolt flying keys i love it and then if we close it back up turn it round we have got harry's address on there and um, Blue Sky Studios, yeah, it's a licensed product. I really like that notebook. We know how I feel about my Harry Potter notebooks. And um, yeah, this is a really cool one for the collection. I am really enjoying this box so far. I'm not gonna lie, not gonna lie. Okay, so I have had a spoiler for this box, but only because some people got this item. <laughs> in their September box and they had a bit of a mix up. And um, so I have seen this item and I have to say, I was very excited about seeing this. So it's a tote bag with the Whomping Willow on and the Ford Anglia obviously stuck in the Whomping Willow from Chamber of Secrets. This bag is gorgeous. The detail on that, I really, I love the Whomping Willow. And I, when I saw a little glimpse of this from a September box, I was like, and obviously I realized then that it was gonna be in the back to school box and I thought mm, I love it this is something that not only will I use I will use this it will also be displayed so that I can see it at all times because I really really do like this tote bag it is gorgeous I absolutely love that design I am loving this box so far okay next thing I'm pulling out Okay, so we have got a licensed Harry Potter Jotter set. This is cool. I do like my stationery. Let's open it up and have a look. I bought the Greg Who Lived one of these, I think, for his birthday, if I remember rightly. I'm sure I did. Oh, we have stickers as well, spoiling us. Okay, so I've pulled everything out. So on the back, this can actually be cut out. It is a postcard but it's a Hogwarts postcard. I do like that. It's kind of got a bit of a, a shimmer. No, it hasn't. It just looks like it has on camera. It, it does really look like it's shimmering on camera, but it's not. It's a matte finish, but I do like that. That is really, really nice. <laughs> it's not, I won't send it to anyone because I'm mean, I'll keep it. And then we have some stickers. So we have got the Hogwarts crest. Look at this. And then the house mascots. So we've got two of those. So we've got some nice stickers there. Do you know, I do have quite a lot of Harry Potter stickers now. I do. And they're all still on their backings. I need to find somewhere for Harry Potter stickers. <laughs> and then we've got, obviously, a notebook here. And it does stay on the front property of, so you can put your name on that. Okay, that's cool. I do like it when you can personalise things. And then it's just plain paper inside. But yeah, it's good for putting shopping lists on. It's perfect size for your handbag or your backpack or whatever you wear. Very nice. And look at your quill. This is so cool. It says Hogwarts on there. Stop focusing on my face. Oh, look, it's so pretty and gold. And then, yeah, it's a ballpoint pen. That is really cool. Oh, I like that. I never, obviously, like I said, I got Greg it for his birthday. Um, and I never bought myself one, and I don't know why, but I've got one now. It's fine. Okay, so this is the item that... Okay, so two items were mixed up and put in the September box, not just the one item, because I got this in September's box. It's the Luna bookmark. Let's open it up. Let's open it up. 
so they must have done it with two items because if i remember rightly the ones that got the tote bag in the september box didn't get this the ones that got this didn't get the tote bag obviously i got this in september's box but i didn't get the tote bag but again i'll show you again anyway in case you didn't see the september's box we've got a lunar love god magnetic bookmark and i like hearing this cool just in case you didn't hear it I'm so stupid. It's unreal. Right, what have we got next? We've got a coin. I do like it when Geeky do these coins. I'm going to forget there's a wand there. I'm going to put it next to me. It's a coin. What we got? Oh, okay. This is such a cool idea. I would like this. It's a free hot meal token. So obviously for the canteen. Okay. I like that. So obviously on the front there, we've got a bubbling, a cauldron bubbling over. And then on the back there, we have a cracked cauldron. That is, I, I do like that idea, a free hot meal token. <coughs> That's a cool idea. And I, ooh, I do like Geek Gears coins because they're very good material. They've got a bit of weight to them. They're not like massively heavy, like stupidly heavy, but they have a good weight to them. And um, yeah, I've I've enjoyed collecting their coins. So far, guys, yeah, still, I'm really enjoying this box. Okay, so we have the cheat sheet there. We have a print here, and it's framed. I do like it when they do them framed. Let's have a look at this. <laughs> I'm going to take it out of all the packaging for us to see, because I think the studio light... <clears throat> will get in the way it still will but hopefully not as much if i take all the packaging off are you ready this it's just yeah it's just the picture isn't it it's just the what's the word i'm looking for iconic is that the word i'm looking for oh it's gorgeous and i love the black frame that it's in that is going straight on my art wall that is absolutely gorgeous absolutely gorgeous let's move on to the wand before we move on to the cheat sheet do we get a house wand it's oh i've just realized it's good that they put a wand in because obviously oh no that would be first year at hogwarts not back to school anyway anyway um we didn't get a wand card in the box so i'm assuming it might be in here but this is just a plain back black black box did i say back box Okay, let's have a look no stop it that is so nice it's not a wand <laughs> it's not a wand it's a broom my voice went then i'm so sorry oh my days that is gorgeous it's very well made it's a miniature broom i really like that oh geeky stop it that's so nice that is so so nice what do you guys think obviously it's in a box so i thought it was a wand and it's not a wand it's a broom it was a nice surprise I'm really chuffed with that. That is nice. So I'm guessing, obviously, it's the Nimbus 2000. Oh, that is gorgeous. That's really made me smile. And I'm not going to lie, it's been a while since a product out of a Geek Gear box has wowed me. It's been a couple of months, so it's been nice to be wowed. And I do have to say, I have really enjoyed this box. Um yeah let's do the cheat sheet and then we'll have a quick talk about it but i did really enjoy this box okay so the back to school limited edition dear students thank you for purchasing this geek year limited edition box back to school box we hope these are dinky doodads <laughs> and crafted cute i can't read now curious bring you luck in your adventure into wizardry education and that your school shopping list is made a little shorter yes i think we're covered okay so we got the wizardry high street t-shirt okay so it's wizardry high street 
I'm still not sure how I feel about the t-shirt. I love, I do love the black t-shirts. A lot of people moan that they do black t-shirts a lot, but I personally like a black t-shirt because black hides lumps and bumps. Um, I'm not sure on the design on it. Um, it's nice, but this is probably going to be one that I wear lounging about. It, I will wear it, but it will be a lounging about one, I think, that one, because I like it, but I don't, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about the t-shirt. I don't know. What do you think? Let me know in the comments, as always. Licensed and exclusive Hogwarts Black and Black Lake framed print. That print is absolutely stunning. I absolutely love that. And honestly, I am going to go find my hammer, get a nail hammered in my art wall and get that hung up because that is beautiful. I really, really love that. Then we've got the Wizardry High Street Pub Hot, oh, Pub Hot Meal Token. I love that. I love that idea. It's so good. The Wizardry School Pet Owl Plush. I do like that. It's really cute. I love a plush though. I do love a plush. It is really nice. Um, Schoolhouses Sorted Initiation Medal. Where is it? That medal is so cool. I could actually see me getting sorted and then they're just putting this round my neck and I'm like, Ravenclaws, fellow Ravenclaws, where are my fellow Ravenclaws at? Ravenclaw pride. Yeah, I'm really happy with this medal. I like it. I do like the idea. Then we've got a luxury wizardry broom replica. Where are you? There you are. That is gorgeous. It's a perfect size for a shelf. You could have it, I mean, obviously I've got areas, so they're like rooms. I could have it propped in the corner of Weasley Wizard Weasley. Oh my days, oh my days, I'm so excited, I love it, I love it. Then we've got the license and exclusive stationery set. Can't go wrong with a bit of stationery for me because I do love stationery. Um, and we've got the Wizardry School Shop Bag for Life, which, yes. Yes, I really, really, really like this item. I really like that, it's gorgeous. Okay, let's just talk about favourites. <clears throat> Favourite item from the box. I think I'm going to say this. I think if I didn't know about this, it would have been this is my favourite. And not going to lie, I, I've enjoyed so much out of this box and I really, really have. But this wowed me. This absolutely wowed me. So I'm going to say the broom is my favourite item. Least favourite item, I'm going to say the t-shirt just because I don't know how I feel about it. Let's have another look. I love the colours. It's not screaming magical like a Diagon Alley. It's not screaming that magic for me. It just looks like a street. I don't know. I don't know. What do you think? Let me know in the comments. Overall, I absolutely enjoyed this box. Hang on, what's the notebook mentioned? Oh, this is cool. So on the back, we've got obviously um, your school list. That's really cool. Parents are reminded that first years are not allowed their own broomsticks. Oh, I like this. Sorry, I didn't see this on the back. Normally I do read the whole of a cheat sheet. It didn't say, um, was the notebook an extra? The notebook's not on here. Did we get an extra? Did you get a notebook? This one, this notebook. Let me know in the comments. But yeah, anyway, 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 anyway. I absolutely love this box. I have to say, Geek Year, you've done really, really well. Like I said, um, nothing's wowed me recently out of Geek Year, but I have been wowed and I know I've had a smile on my face quite a lot throughout unboxing this and I have genuinely really, really enjoyed unboxing this. Um, I do like as well on their limited edition boxes. I'm not normally too bothered about a pattern on the box it comes in because you can't really keep all the boxes, <laughs> but I do like these limited edition boxes and it's nice because you can keep the limited edition ones and then obviously the normal monthly ones you could to be fair i do tend to keep them because i use them for storage a lot or i use them if i'm sending parcels myself we recycle these boxes geek gear but what did you think to the back to school box from geek gear what did you think guys as a whole what did you think of the box did you have a favorite item what was your least favorite item did you not enjoy the box talk to me in the comments you know i love it when we have a chat 
But yeah, that is the end of today's video. I have got a massive smile on my face. I can't wait to edit this and get it up for you all to see. And yeah, I will speak to you all in my next video. Bye, Pods Poppets. <laughs>